Hey guys, today on Kids New Toys, I'm going to show you how to make this adorable bracelet out of La La Loopsie Tinies. So I don't know if you guys have seen the commercial yet for La La Loopsie Tinies, but at the end, they show the little girls wearing necklaces and bracelets made out of tinies. So if you haven't seen it, just go to YouTube and type in La La Loopsie Tinies commercial. And I will also try to put a link to it in the description part of this video. So these are the supplies you will need. Some kind of ruler or tape measure. Clear nail polish. Scissors. Some La La Loopsie Tinies. Anywhere from one to about five of these would work. Some beads. And some elastic cord. And in case you're wondering, I found these beads and this sparkle elastic cord in the children's crafting department at Joanne's Fabric and Crafts. I made this bracelet with a clear elastic cord that I bought in the jewelry making department. But for this video, I'm going to use this Clubhouse Crafts sparkle elastic cord. It's a little bit thicker and I think it'll be a little easier to work with. Plus, I think the colored cord will be really cute because sometimes it does show through on your bracelet. So before we start, I just want to say I recommend this project for children ages 4 and up. It's not really appropriate for anyone under 3 just because these are pretty small objects and you wouldn't want them to get a hold of that. And for my little viewers out there, please have your mom or dad help you out with this project. So to start with, we're going to take our elastic cord and measure out 9 inches without stretching your cord. And I know that probably seems like a lot, but we are going to have um, some extra to tie the knot at the end. And if you have a lot of extra, you can always snip it off, but it's better to have too much to start with than not enough. So the next step is really the fun part where we get to start putting our beads and our La La Loopsies on our bracelet. And this is where it's good to have someone to help you to hold one end of the cord. Um, and I'll show you why in a second. But you can start with one of the La La Loopsies and they do already have a hole drilled right through them so it makes it perfect for them to make a charm bracelet with. So you just run it through and just be careful not to get busy putting your beads on and then let the cord run out the other end. You can also tie a knot at the end too to keep that from happening. So I'm just going to put these on here. And another cute thing to do would be to just make a bracelet out of all your La La Loopsie Tiny Pets. And you can just do one La La Loopsie and then all beads. Um, or if you have a really small wrist, you might only need two or three La La Loopsies and then you could fill the rest up with beads. You can do it however you want. So I have a grown up wrist and I have probably a small to average size wrist and I have five La La Loopsies on here. So I'm going to finish stringing these up and then I'll be back to show you what to do next. So I have all of my La La Loopsie Tinies on my cord and I alternated one tiny with one bead and I just chose to match the bead with the hair color of the La La Loopsie Tiny. So the next thing you're going to do is tie a knot with your two ends. So this is a good part to have mom or dad help you out with. 
I'm just tying a simple knot here, but you might want to do something fancier if you know how. A lot of the cord that you can buy actually has a knot tying guide on the package. So let me show you the one that I purchased has a guide underneath the cord here so you can follow that. And then you can put a little dab of nail polish on your knot just to help seal it and make it a little stronger. Okay, so here's our finished bracelet. I think it turned out pretty cute. Let me try it on. So you can layer them up and do as many as you want. And you could just buy a package of tinies and make one for yourself and some for your friends. Well, thanks for watching my video, guys. Stay tuned for more from Kids New Toys, where we unbox, review, and play with new toys. And sometimes we make crafts. If you like this video, please click like and subscribe to my channel. Thanks. Bye.